Veronica Kudabatova versus Annalena Kalanina is the first semi-final for the Ladies Rome Open for 2023. And both ladies have been very impressive to get to this stage. Kalanina started the tournament off as the 30th seed, and we get a buy in the first round. In the second round, she take on Blinkova. This is no problem for Kalanina, getting through in straight sets. 6-2, 6-2. In the third round, she take on Sofia Kennan, who had just demolished the number two seed Sabalenka in the previous round. This is no problem for Kalanina, getting through in straight sets. 6-4, 6-2. In the fourth round, she take on Madison Keys, who had been given a walkover victory against Azarenka in the previous round. And after dropping the first set, Kalanita would fight back, getting through in three, two, six, six, two, six, four, to advance to the quarterfinals. In the quarterfinals, Kalanita would take on the number 12 seed, Hadaj Maya, who she'd played three times previously. And this match was brutal. After losing the first set, she'd have to come back to win in a three hour and 45 minute match, six, seven, seven, six, six, three, to advance to the semifinals. Kudabatova entered the tournament as the number 11 seed, and we'll get a buy in the first round. In the second round, she'd take on Diaz. This was no problem for Kudabatova, getting through in Straits, 7-5-6-2. In the third round, she'd take on the 23rd seed Potapova, who she'd had to battle through last week in Madrid. And this was no different. Going to a third set with Kudamatova eventually winning, 7-5-3-6-6-1 to get to the fourth round. In the fourth round, she'd take on the 27th seed Buskova, who'd just taken out Goff in three sets. And this was so far the easiest match for Kudamatova, getting through in straight sets, 6-2-6-2 to advance to the quarterfinals. In the quarterfinals, Kudamatova would take on the number 22 seed Zhang. And after dropping the first set, she'd have to fight back to win, 3 6-6-3-6-4 six, six, to advance to the semi-finals. These two have played twice before with their recent meeting being in Dubai a couple of months ago with Kalanina winning 7-5 in a third set. This would be a clay court so the conditions would be a lot slower than they were back then. Kalanina's going to win this one. She needs to get everything back. Kudamatova is probably going to be the more aggressive player on this surface even though she's good on clay. So Kalanina's going to have to really be defensive but also it's probably going to come down to fitness as well because coming off a three and a half hour match is going to be brutal. is going to win this one. She needs to be aggressive but she also wouldn't mind the match going for maybe two hours plus because of course the fitness levels of Kalanina after that epic match she played in the quarterfinals might come back to hurt her the longer the match goes here. So Kudamatova doesn't need to play a fast match, but maybe wearing a Kalanina wouldn't be a bad idea. This is going to be a really fun matchup. We haven't seen these two play in this stage of a big event like this, but I'm going to go with Kudamatova. She's been in such good form on the clay the last couple of weeks, and she has the experience level at this level, of course, being a higher ranked player. I think she might get the job done, especially on the clay courts as well. Let me know down in the comments below who's making the final of Rome.